Seven years after the loss of a dear friend, a group of local high school seniors is off to college with a little heavenly help. After losing their 10 year old daughter, a Choctaw family made it their mission to keep her giving spirit alive by helping the friends and community she'd loved so dearly. News Force Lauren Daniels with more. She was one of those children that when you have them, they make you just want to have 10 more. In her only decade on this earth, Lene Johnston left a lasting impact on everyone who knew her. She was really outgoing and bubbly. I remember she convinced me to sing in the fourth grade talent show, and I'm not a singer, but it was really fun. <laughs> Lene loved being part of the fifth grade cheer team in Choctaw. I remember that she just loved cheerleading, and she just loved being around everyone. But on January 25th, 2015, the Johnston family and Lene's beloved teammates were rocked by tragedy. She did pass away unexpectedly. She'd had a, a short stint with a mild illness, and we didn't uh, figure out until after her passing that it was due to a heart condition. Um, she had been healthy up until that point. We all kind of just went through it together, and it was easier to have each other during that time. Seven years later, that fifth grade cheer team is all grown up, but has remained close with Lene's mother, Diana. One of the biggest fears is. You know, you never want your child to be forgotten. And uh, these girls, our family, community has never even let that enter their minds. The year after she passed, the Johnston family started a foundation in Lene's honor to help graduating seniors. Through fundraisers like bracelet sales, they've raised thousands of dollars. Spike! Jackie Spike! Now, as these girls head off to college, they'll be doing so with a little help from their guardian angel. I can speak for a lot of us being like th very thankful that th the Johnston family was nice enough to give back to us um, through everything that they've gone through. Lene's mom says it's exactly what she would have wanted. She um, really had a giving heart and always wanted to please others. And by the grace of God and our friends and family, uh, we're, we're still here, able to celebrate her. In Choctaw, Lauren Daniels, Oklahoma's News 4. If you'd like to help support the Lene Johnston Building Our Future Foundation, we do have a link at KFOR.com.